Hi, in this video, we will be talking about how to read the LED lights on our CPX Classic. My name is Michael Charisma, and I'm a mechatronics engineer here at Festo. When controlling the CPX Classic, this is the normal LED configuration that you'll see on your main bus node. You'll see that it's a green light on the MS, which is going to stand for the module status. You have a green light on the PS, which is the power status or power supply. You have a green light on your NS, which stands for your network status. Green light on your PL, which is your power load. If you have a device connected to your input or your output, you'll see that these lights will be triggering on and off. Normally, we'll just have one connected, so that's why I just had the, the single LED on. Your SF light or your system fault light will be off, as well as your manual light will be off. If you see a solid LED light on your NS, this means that you have a communication fault and your IPHS is probably incorrect. Please double check the IP configuration settings to see if this is valid. If your NS light is flashing, Please check to make sure that the I.O. connections are all good and there is no timeout issues related to your master to your scanner. If your system fault LED flashes one time, you have a minor error, also called a fault class 1 error. You can read more about the types of errors and how to figure out the solutions to them in the CPX system description manual that will be posted in the description below. If your system fault flashes twice periodically, this means that you have a class 2 error. It is a, more serious than a class 1 error, but not as serious as a class 3 error. You can read the diagnosis and the solution in the CPX system description also posted below. If you have three flashes on your LED periodically, this is a serious error, also considered a fault class 3 error. Majority of the times, this is non-recoverable but please refer to the documentation below to see what the diagnosis and possible solutions, if any. If your NS status is flashing green, your CPX has received an IP address but is not fully configured. Please check the CPX configuration to make sure that all the extra additional module cards are properly loaded onto the main configuration. If you have a solid LED light on the manual or modify, LED, this means that the settings have been saved inside the CPX itself, meaning that possibly the IP address could have been changed or any of the additional safety requirements were changed. If you have a flashing yellow light on the manual or modify LED, this will be considered a forcing is active, meaning that using one of the Festo provided softwares, you are manually controlling the inputs or outputs that are connected to the CPX field bus node. If the PS light is blinking rapidly green on the module, this indicates the operating voltage is outside of the tolerance range. To correct the issue, uh, rectify the under voltage supplied to the module. If the PS light is blinking green at a moderate rate, this indicates that the internal fuse has been tripped. To rectify this error, fix the short circuit or the overload voltage. If the PL light is blinking green at a moderate rate, this indicates that the load voltage is outside of the tolerance range. To fix this, rectify the under voltage. If the MS light is blinking green at a moderate rate, this implies that the configuration of the CPX terminal has not been completed. To rectify this error, complete or correct configuration of the CPX terminal. If the MS light is solid red, this is an error that cannot be rectified. Contact Festo customer service for help.